could you explain to my listeners what is forest bathing and how is it different from just walking in the forest? Yeah, in fact, forest bathing is from the Japanese Shinrin Yoku. Yeah, Shinrin in Japanese means forest. Yoku means bus. So Shinrin Yoku just take forest atmosphere through our five senses. Sense of the smell, sense of the sight, sense of hearing, sense of the touch, and sense of taste. So you just being nature, being forest, very slow walk. It is very important that you enjoy the forest atmosphere by your five senses. So forest bathing is a total effect from the five senses. Ah. So this is a forest bathing. So, and it's different from just walking that you engage all the senses. Yeah. So, the, yeah. Uh, there are well, one key, key word. Key word is five senses is a key word for the forest bathing. I mean, if you just uh, uh, take a walk in the forest, but you don't use the five senses, it's a not forest bathing. Just the walking, walking in the forest. <laughs> so, because, yeah, when you stay in the forest, uh, you, if you just take a walk, you maybe uh, miss miss anything from the forest. But if you take a slow walk and uh, enjoy the forest atmosphere by your five senses, you can listen to the bird song. You can smell the yeah the scent from the trees. You also can yeah put your whole body in the forest atmosphere to enjoy the all the atmosphere. You also can see beautiful, yeah, beautiful, we call the forest landscape. The green color, yellow color, and red color. Yeah, many, many, yeah. You also can uh, see some, we call the komori bee, the, the, the sun from the leaf. So you just, uh, yeah, see the sky through the Leave of the trees. You can see the very beautiful, beautiful scenery. We call it the Komorebi. Komorebi. Komorebi, yeah. It's a sun, yeah, just the sun filter, filter, filtered by the leaves of the tree. So you will very mild, mild sunlight. It's good for your eye. So it's a total effect. Five senses. And what are the benefits? You do the research. Ah. What is the benefits? Yeah. In fact, from the 2004, I have started my research on forest bathing at Shinrin-yoku. So I have conducted about 20, 20 researchers, 20 studies so far. So uh, forest bathing can reduce your blood pressure, reduce your heart rate, and reduce your stress hormone. Do you know stress hormone? The uh, uh, cortisol, adrenaline, noradrenaline. So forest bathing can boost your immune system. So we call the natural killer cells. So natural killer cells can kill tumor cells, also the virus infected cells, and also bacteria. Even it can kill the COVID-19. It can cure COVID. So, yeah, but that was COVID my question yeah, yeah. because uh, yeah. low stress, yeah. immune so for, system. I was my question to you. Like, like, we are in lockdown as well on the Netherlands. Yeah, lockdown. Yeah. So we need so to go to the bathing, forest. Yeah. Yeah. So forest bit. So forest bathing also can improve your sleep, reduce your negative feelings, and improve your positive feelings. For example. Forest bathing can reduce your negative feeling, such as uh, anxiety, depression, anger, fatigue, confusing. So, so it's a, it will have the preventive uh, effect on the depression. Depression. So okay. For yeah. Example, yeah. For example, during the uh, epidemic of the COVID nineteen, many people will feel a lot of mental stress. Yes. Because the lockdown, 
isolation and keep the yeah also keep the social distance and uh, yeah you cannot drink out you cannot eat out you have to stay stay in the in your home so it will produce a lot of mental stress but the fourth vision can reduce the mental stress so fourth vision also can improve the immune function in fact people with lower uh, with lower immune function will show more yeah mortality higher mortality rate of the COVID-19 for example older people older people and the people with some diseases uh, such as diabetes hypertension cardiovascular diseases so those people because those people have a lower immune function in fact yeah impaired immune function so because fourth vision can boost your immune function can reduce your stress hormone can reduce your mental stress so COVID-19 uh, so fourth vision also have some positive effect preventive effect on the COVID-19 are you are you doing research uh, on COVID and forest bathing as well? Yeah, in fact, I conducted research with the Italia group. With the Italia group, so uh, this is research is from the Italia. I yeah, I give the advice to the research in Italia, and they published a paper recently. So just uh, see the video. See the DVD video, take the, vi the video of the fourth landscape. So people just re yeah, watch the, yeah. So people just videos. watch a video of the forest video, yeah, and they yeah, improve? Video, uh, they yeah, will reduce the mental stress. Oh. Yeah, this is a recent, very new, new research. So, but then what about the smell and the sun if you're just watching so, a video? Yeah, yeah. Well, good question. In fact, first bit is a total five senses. But uh, in the, if you just watch DVD, this is just one sense. One sense. It's a sense of the sight. So, but the sense of sight also have a positive effect. So you cannot get the, all of the first bit effect, but you can get a part of the first bit effect. And what is the, the protocol, the procedure? Like how long uh, I go into the forest? How long should I go? Oh, really? Okay. In fact, uh, uh, from the 20 minutes, so it's better to stay longer in the forest. But uh, from the 20 minutes, the effect will be started. After so 20 just, minutes? Uh, yeah, so the effect is from the 20 minutes. But the longer is better. Yeah. In fact, uh, if you want to, if you want to uh, boost your immune function, I suggest I recommend you stay in the forest for uh, two nights, three days. It's longer, yeah, for vacation, for vacation, for the weekend, weekend, vacation. So, if you because the two nights, three day forest bathing can boost the immune function. And this effect can last for 30 days. So two nights, three days, four days can keep your uh, immune function in higher level for 30 days. Wow. But if you don't have time, you also can take a day, a day trip of the four days. A day trip, just uh, four to six hours can keep your, can in, also can uh, increase your immune function and this effect can last for one week so six hours four to six hours can keep uh, immune function in higher level for one week so two four hours one week two nights three two nights three days for 30 days and all this but, yeah and all but this if you just want to yeah want to get a relaxing uh, two hours, two hours is enough for the, the psychological effect. We call the relaxation. And, and what I love it is that it's all backed up by scientific data. 
Yeah, we have the scientific uh, scientific data. Yeah, and I when I what I this is a scientific book, first medicine. Can you see the title? No, no? it's the background. <laughs> it's the trees. Background, uh, background. <laughs> oh, maybe one? before so, your body. If you put it here, I can see the book. No, the, yeah, yeah, yeah. Are? For oh, first you medicine. Yes. First medicine. So this is a scientific book. We have a lot of data, a lot of figure. For example, a lot of figure, a lot of data. So, in fact, this book, this book is from this book. Ah, this yeah. is a public book. Yeah. So there are no, yeah, no many data, just a description. Yeah. But this is a, this is a scientific book. So many, many data, for example, like this one. Yeah. Okay. Many, many data. Okay. <laughs> I can see. You can see. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so, in fact, I have uh, uh, studied the Fort Beijing from 2004, almost uh, 16 years. 16 years of research. Why six? Why six? Yeah. yeah. Why six years? Yeah. And what I what I noticed in the book in Japan, you have mm. uh, forest baiting centers with yeah, doctors yeah, and checkpoints the, uh, and and uh, trails. Yeah, trails. Yeah, this is not the center. Uh, we call the forest therapy base. Uh, again, so forest therapy. Forest therapy. Forest therapy base. Okay. B, B A S E. Peace. Peace. B A S E. No, no, no. B. No, the P. B. Base. Oh, base. Base. Yes. Okay. Basement. Yeah, basement. Yeah. Fourth, fourth therapy base. Uh -huh. We call that. But you also got the fourth therapy center. And so, okay. Yeah. And, um, can this be all over the world? Because Japan has a lot of forest. Yeah. Um, in fact, uh, how, uh, how big should the forest yeah. be for one yes. center? Yeah. So, so. In fact, uh, the forest rate, the cover, cover, coverage rate of the forest, uh, about 70%. 70% of Japan is forest. In Japan. In, yeah. Two, yeah. Two and three, two and the third, two and the third, the land, a forest. So 70% of the land is forest in Japan. And uh, the, the forest therapy uh, base. Center, um, base, yeah. Uh, center, base. <laughs> um, base it's okay. Center the, the, is basically similar, yeah. People go there to yeah. heal. Yeah. And there's a doctor on the base that, for checkups, yeah, yeah. right? Yeah, I will, yeah, explain. I will explain the forest therapy base. So, there are a lot of forests in Japan, but uh, the forest base is scientific, scientific proved by, by the experiment. So okay. if you visit that forest, you will get the beneficial effect from the forest. So mm -hmm. we have the data. Ah, it's for doing research. Hey, so we have the data for that forest. So after we conduct the research, and confirm the effect of the forest bathing. So that forest will be identified, identified as a forest therapy base or forest therapy center. So we have the another, so we call the forest, uh, forest therapist, do you know forest therapist? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So we have a lot of forest therapist in Japan. So uh, those forest therapy, this will stay, stay in the fourth base. So they will guide you to visit the fourth therapy center. So this is old Japan, old Japan, yeah. So for some fourth base, there are also a doctor, a medical doctor uh, stay there, but just the one fourth therapy center. That is uh, the first place of the Fort, uh, Fort Beijing in Japan. I think maybe you know Akasawa Recreation Forest. No, you don't no. know. No, I've, I've, maybe I think on the map in the book, but no. Well, my map is the book, yeah. yeah. It's uh, the first place. That is uh, 
first place of the fourth Beijing in Japan. Ah. And yeah. is it possible to start a, a clinic, for example, in the Netherlands? How big yeah, does yeah. the forest need to be? Or, or can, everyone, can everyone do this at home? Or uh, how big no. does a... Uh, so how big for the forest? Eh? Yeah. Yeah. The forest is very big, but there are no houses. They just visit the forest for daytime. So during the stay, you just stay in a hotel near the fort, but you cannot stay uh, stay at the forest in the night during the night. Oh, you cannot so stay you just, in the forest. No, so you just visit because uh, for the during the night, the the atmosphere is not good for home health because a lot of uh, less oxygen. I think maybe you know. During the daytime, the tree will produce, produce the oxygen and will, yeah, absorb the, uh, di uh carbon, carbon dioxide. Mm -hmm. We call the C, CO2. Yeah. You know CO2? Yeah. Yeah. Yes. So, so during the, during the, uh, night time, the first, the tree will produce CO2. And we will use the, we will use the, the, the oxygen to produce CO2. So during the night time, it's the first atmosphere is not good for home house. Mm -hmm. Because of low concentration of the oxygen. I understand. So at so, night. So, 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 so you have to, yeah. On my, yeah. Uh, from my research, you just visit the forest during the daytime. For example, from the 10, AM to the 4 PM. From 10 to 4, yeah? Yeah, yeah. Due the, uh, yeah. Due the sun shining. Ah, and do you Time take wise. like, uh, exercise? You cannot, you cannot visit the fort after sunset. sunset. Okay, okay. After sunset, you don't visit the fort. So you visit in the daytime when the sun is shining? Yes, yeah, sun is shining. Yeah. yeah. And do you take yeah. like exercises with you or uh, do yeah. you need to write or? Okay, so you so the, in fact during the fourth Beijing, you can take uh, uh, any take some uh, activity like uh, Tai Chi, Tai Chi. Do you know Tai Chi? Yeah. You also can yeah uh, yoga, yoga, yoga breathing. Mm. So in, in fact during the fourth Beijing, usually I recommend the people to take a deep breathing. Deep breathing. Breathing, yeah. yeah. Take deep breathing, yes. And uh, you also can take a picnic with your friend or mm -hmm. your family. But uh, please, uh, yeah, remember, you just uh, use your five senses as much as possible. So you just go, yeah. use your senses as much as possible, maybe do some yoga, breathing, yoga. or... Yeah, deep breathing or Tai Chi. Yeah. Mm. Uh, but yeah. you can also, so you don't have to go go alone. You can go with your family as well together. So it's dependent. Uh, yeah, the the, the uh, your yeah. Some people, some people maybe want to visit the forest alone, but some people want to visit for to visit the, with a family or friends. Some people also want to visit the forest for for to visit a guide like a forest therapist. Mm. So, so there is so. Many, yeah, there is, there is no one size for all solution. Yeah, yeah. no, no one size. <laughs> no, no one size. Yeah. It's depends on your, your uh, professor. And what does um, a forest bathing guide, the therapy, the, the yeah. therapist, what do, therapy, yeah. what does he do? So they will guide you to take a forest uh, therapy during the, yeah, during the, yeah, trails. So they, the, for, the forest therapist know the forest well, very much. So they know the uh, story about the forest. They know the, yeah, the history about the forest, the forest therapy center. Also, he know, uh, he have some, uh, acknowledge of the, uh, like, uh, 
fight with a fight, fight with a fight with a flower with the trees and so so they can give you yeah give you uh, advice and uh, depending on your uh, uh, physical physical uh, physical ability so before the fourth vision they will ask you some questions and uh, uh, give you a plan that uh, suits for you. So it's so, a guide that... It's a, it's a, yeah, it's very similar to a nature guide. Mm. For example, if you visit some places, maybe you can uh, yeah, uh, see some nature guide. It's very similar, yeah. So many, yeah, many forest therapists is from the nature guide. Yeah, so they know nature very much. They know, uh, yeah. And, and they help so you have, with... Yeah, in fact, we have a training course. We have a training course for the first therapist. So after they receive the training course of the first therapist, we will give the, his, some of the certification. Mm -hmm. Certified, so, yeah. Certified, certified kit, certified kit. In fact, in Japan, there are about uh, 1,000, about 1,000 people, 1,000 forest therapists in Japan. 140 therapists? No, 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 1,000. 1,000? Yeah, 1,000 oh. in whole Japan. And is it's part of the healthcare in Japan? Yeah, healthcare, yeah. Like healthcare, yeah. Yes, which is very similar to healthcare. So maybe some people, some forest therapy with the a background of the nurses, also some people, medical doctor, medical doctor, and some is uh, like uh, health, health, yeah, health care work. And so also some people from the nature, nature guide. Yeah. Okay. Um, hmm. And uh, how did you get into this topic? Uh, it's a topic, the fourth page. Eh? Yeah, for you. So it's a, yeah, it's a long story. <laughs> it's okay. That's okay. <laughs> in fact, uh, yeah, I, I was born in a uh, very small village in China. Mm -hmm. So in my village, there are a lot of poplar, I mean, the poplar forest, poplar forest, very high poplar forest. Mm. And also the apricot, apricot forest. Mm -hmm. So pop, uh, popular. So from my uh, childhood, yeah, mm -hmm. I, from childhood, I, yeah, live in the nature. So I love the nature. I love the forest. And uh, after I uh, graduated from uh, university, medical university in China, I came to Japan. I'm Chinese, but I'm Chinese. I came to Japan for over 30 years. So, so in fact, during my study in Kagoshima University, when I was a student, I visited one of the famous island. Maybe you know Yakushima. Yeah. You know, you don't in my book there is Yakushima. Very small island in, in South South Japan. Yeah, I know it. But uh, yeah, very beautiful, very beautiful forest. Uh, the Japanese we call it Japanese cedar. Japanese cedar. Japanese cedar. Yeah. Lots of yeah, Japanese cedar forest. Very famous. So when I visited there, I found the beneficial effect of uh, forbidden. Because uh, my major, my major is uh, environmental medicine. Environmental medicine. So I'm a medical doctor. So because my major is uh, environment, environmental medicine. In fact, forest, forest environment is also one kind of environment. So, for, in fact, I said, some people study first, some people study medicine. I study first medicine to find the beneficial effect on home health, beneficial effect of forest phasing on home health. So it's my background. Another background, in fact, uh, I studied the Stanford University, Stanford University in America mm -hmm. for one year. Yeah. I, I studied the, the effect of the 
uh, anti-cancer protein, you know, anti-cancer protein or hormone house. Uh, anti-cancer, so, you mean? Yeah, yeah. Anti-cancer protein, yeah, like yeah. granulation, preferring granulation. And uh, so I must, I must, uh, I learned the measurement of, of how to measure the, the me I learned the more me method of how to measure the anti cancer protein in natural killer cells. So I have the technology, technology for measure, for, for measuring the, uh, anti cancer protein. So after I, uh, returned to Japan, the Japanese government, the Japanese government wanted, wanted to explore the effect of for phasing of home house. So they invite, invite, invited me as a main member of the, this project. So the government gave me a lot of grant, like uh, research, yeah, research, research grant. Mm -hmm. So um, it's a, it's a big, like uh, about uh, for three years, about uh, 1.5 million dollar. 1.4 million dollar for doing dollar research. For three years. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry, this is, this is a big, yes, this is a big money, big project. Mm. So this, that, that was uh, 2004, about 16 years ago. So I've, because I know medicine, I know, also know for the environment. So I can do this research very well because I have my background of the stress of the for uh, of the for the environment. Also, the uh, immunology because I, yeah, I learned a lot of, uh, yeah, technique of the immunology from the Stanford University. So I know, know all the background of the fort. So, so the government, uh, yeah, uh, gave me, yeah, big project for this research. So I started my research from 2004. And uh, I conduct the experiment almost uh, one or two every year. Oh, that's so a total lot. I have yeah, conducted about 20, 20 experiments on the topic of the fort phasing. I love it. Uh, so in fact, I, I, this is a fort medicine is a new science. I, I established this is new science. Forest medicine. So, yeah, it's <laughs> a new science. It's a preventive medicine. What is the, the next research going to be in the future of the forest bathing? Yeah, in fact, in the future, I will apply the forest therapy, forest bathing in the rehabilitation medicine. You know the rehabilitation medicine from people, yeah. And this one. Uh, another one, recently, I started a uh, new research. I used the phytocide, the, the smell, phytocide, the aroma. Aroma, yeah. Uh, yeah. To on the patients with the dementia. Okay. Because in Japan, I think in the world, like, are a lot of patients with the dementia, but there are no, no treatment method. So the, the prevention is very important because the, the aroma, aroma will stimulate, stimulate your, your oxford, oxfactor nerve. Yeah. And will have, yeah, some yeah, good effect on the memory. Ah, so the so, aroma stimulates the, the olfactory, which stimulates yeah. the memory. Memory. So memory. So, so I think it will have some positive effect. But uh, this is research, I just started this research from this year. It will take a long time, I think uh, three or four years. So next step I will, yeah, so this is a project. Um, and what kind of ailments, um, because this is dementia, wh what kind of ailments mm. would you love to research as well? Maybe, maybe COVID or? Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, at a lot of, there are a lot of work to do for the forest bathing because it's a new science. So, uh, we have to, yeah, 
identify the what, yeah, what, what, which factor, which, which factor in the forest will produce the positive effect of human health. So maybe the fighting side is one kind of uh, factor, but there are still a lot of factors we don't know. So we have to, yeah, continue, continue the research on this topic to confirm, uh, to identify the main, the, the main factor of the fault environment of home house. Yeah, exactly. It's, it's a long way. Yeah, it's a long way. Yeah, it's, uh, I think this is the start of the fault medicine research. Um, look, looking forward to it. I have a maybe strange uh, question, but... Yeah, um, okay. <laughs> um, is there something like plant consciousness? Or what's, what's, what's the do, do you think the plants, the trees can maybe communicate oh, yeah. with each other? In fact, yeah, because, yeah. So some people think a uh, tree can uh, communicate with each other by, by using the fighting side. Uh, yeah, the fight side. So that's smell, right? Yes, yeah, smell, smell. molecules. Yeah, it's a smell. Yeah, we call the fighting side. It's a, yeah, the, the sense of the smell, because uh, is a, the fighting side is very, very, yeah, very interesting. Because, for example, uh, if uh, you use the higher concentration of the fighting side, it will be toxic. Okay, so for example, yeah. I think you know the aromatherapy. Yeah. So when you use uh, aromatherapy, you cannot uh, use the uh, original of the essential oil. You have to, yeah, yeah, you have to dilute it. Yeah, so it's toxic, yeah. By the, we call it, yeah, we call it carrier oil. What, what kind so of oil? It's, uh, yeah, yeah, carrier, carrier oil. Like, oh. uh, yeah, like olive oil. Oh, I don't know it. The, because I said, so essential oil, you cannot use the original essential oil. Yeah, because it's too much. You have to dilate it. Yeah, yeah. With too, yes, yes, too, the, the concentration too high. Mm -hmm. So you have to dilute it. Dilute it. Dilute it. Yeah. But uh, we call it carrier. Carrier oil. Carrier oil. Or maybe you can uh, write it uh, in the email, the name of it, uh, after, afterwards. Oh, okay. Maybe yeah. later. Yeah, yeah later, later. <laughs> because, yeah, also, we, for example, like the olive oil, usually, yeah, usually the uh, aromatherapist use the olive oil to, yeah, to signal, to signal the, the essential oil. So it's very important. So, in fact, uh, so, so the final side, if you, but in the fourth atmosphere, the concentration of the fungal side is very low. So it's not toxic to, for, for human because the concentration of the uh, fungal side in the air is very low. It's not, they don't have the toxic effect on human health, but just have the beneficial effect on human health. In fact, the, why, why trees and the plants produce the uh, fungicide? Because it's a protect system. So the, the plant produce the fungicide can protect from the other, uh, yeah, like pest, uh, fungi and bacteria. Mm -hmm. So it's a protect, yeah, self protect system. So the different Forest, different trees produce different fighting side. So, so different, yeah. So different trees can, can have the different smell. It's because the fighting side, because of different fighting side. So in fact, uh, the plant and the tree can communicate each other by produce the fighting side. Maybe we, we don't, we don't, yeah, maybe we don't believe that, but it's true. So the, the plants can communicate each other and they pro, pro, 
protect from the others by release fighting side. And these fighting sites are in, in big doses, not good for a uh, toxic for us, but in small yeah, doses, yeah, it's, yeah, it's, yeah, it's helpful. Yeah. Fighting side in higher doses will produce toxic effect. So in fact, in, in my experiment, I use a very lower concentration of the fighting side. I'm, I'm not sure if you, if you know, do you know the PPM or the PPB? Uh, PPM. I this is, uh, yeah, some concentration, the, some, the, the unit of the concentration, PPM. PPM is the value that one, one million. Mm. You, well, yeah, well, maybe you can, you can, you, you can check it later. We call it PPM. PPM is a very lower concentration unit. Yeah. So in my experiment, I use the very lower very well, low concentration of the first phasing and uh, the, the fighting side to incubate with the common immune cell for one week. Uh -huh. So, for example, I this is a test tube. I use the test tube. Uh -huh. I put the yeah, put the fighting side at a very low concentration. Low dose. And I also put the human immune cells, like natural killer cells. And I mix the, mix the, yeah, mix the cell with the fungicide. Then I incubate, put the incubator with the, uh, uh, 70, uh, 37 degree. Very, yeah, very warmer, like the home body. Uh -huh. We call it 30, yeah. 30, 37 degree. We put the incubator at the 37 degree and I incubate the cell with the fighting side for one week. After one week incubation, I measure the, the cell effect, cell, uh, cell activity, NK, we call the NK activity. And I found that the fighting side can increase the Human NK activity with lower, with very lower concentration. So this is the effect of the fighting side. So it increased cell activity. So increase, increase the boost, boost the immune function. Oh, okay. So yeah. fighting sides boosted the immune function. So, so, so fighting side boost the immune function in the test tube. Wow. So. And I also, yeah, I also conducted another research, not uh, in the test tube, on the people in the, so I took some people to stay in a hotel room. So I produced the fountain side in the room where use the, yeah, I use the, some steam, like steam. Ah, you put it in the hotel. Steam. Yeah, in the room hotel, yeah. Okay. Uh, we use the, uh, humi do you know the humidifier? Yes. Humidifier. Yeah. Yeah. I use the humidifier to produce the smell, uh -huh. aroma. Yeah. Yeah. Of the, yeah, for the fighting side. I use the, the best, the best, best quality, <laughs> best quality of the essential oil. Uh, which uh, is, was produced from the, uh, the first place of the fort. Beijing in Japan. Mm -hmm. Maybe you know the Hinoki, Japanese Cypress. I saw it in your from book, the yeah. Japanese, uh, Jap yeah. Japanese, very good tree, from Japanese Cypress tree. So, so that essential oil is, uh, yeah, produced from the uh, Japanese Cypress. So I use that uh, uh, essential oil to produce the aroma in the hotel room. And the subject, people stay in the hotel room for three nights. So for three nights. And during the daytime, they just take the usual work. Yeah. The, okay. All they, yeah. Always stay in the hotel during the night time. So before and after the stay in the hotel, I took the 
blood pressure, a blood sample, blood sample, and also urine sample to measure the immune function and the stress <laughs> hormone. Sorry. So I took the blood pressure and the urine sample to measure the immune function, like NK activity, number of NK cells, and anti-cancer protein. I also measure the stress hormone, like the cortisol, cortisol, and also adrenaline, noradrenaline. So I also measure the sleep condition. Yeah. So after three day, three day stay in the uh, hotel room with the aroma. So uh, people will show the higher NK activity. So the first bit, so the fatty side exposure will increase the increase NK activity. The natural killer cells. Yeah, natural killer, natural killer cell activity, and the number of natural killer cells. Also, the anti-cancer protein in the cells, and reduce the stress hormone, such as cortisol, cortisol and adrenaline, noradrenaline and improve the sleep quality. Yeah. Also can reduce the negative feeling, like such as uh, uh, anxiety, depression, anger, fatigue, confusion. Yeah. And improve the positive feeling, like vigor. And was there so, like a control group that had no... Um, yeah, yeah. We, you, of course, we have the <laughs> control group. People just uh, stay in the hotel room, but uh, without, without uh, fighting side. Yeah. But uh, there are no change for that control group. Really? No change. Yeah. Yeah. So After three days, three nights, uh, yeah, stay in the hotel without, for, without fighting side. Uh, when, when, no you, when you find this, you must like go to all the hospitals and say, look, <laughs> we need yeah, this yeah, in yeah, the yeah, hospitals, yeah. right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> in fact, that was uh, 2008 research. Ten year, about 10 years ago, I finished that research, yeah. And do, do, do they use it now in like in hospitals or in... Uh, yeah, of, of course. In fact, I, I told you, I, I am just... Uh, a study, I'm just studying the effect of the uh, fighting side of dementia. Yeah. So that's in the, in the hospital, in my hospital. In fact, uh, I, now I work at a small hospital with about 200, 200 patients. I, with, uh, yeah, older people, older patients. Mm -hmm. Older patients, yeah, patients. So about, uh, Half of, of the patients will show the symptoms of the dementia, dementia in my whole. So I studied the effect of the fighting side aroma on the, the patient, on the patient with the dementia. And do you then add also like a video or, or is it just the smell? No. So it's just smell. Because wow. this is research, you have to use the one factor. If you use a lot of factor, it will make a confusion. Yeah. So, but after the research, you can use the total effect. But for the research, you have to use the single, single one effect, one factor. After you confirm the effect, you can, yeah, use the two and the three. I yeah. think you... The research stage, you have to use the one. It's a very... Simplified. Yeah, of course. It's be better, mm. better scientific methods, of course. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 And um, you also found effects on uh, creativity and, and uh, cognition. Is that correct? No, no. It's not, it's not my research. It's other ah, okay. research research. Yeah. In fact, in my research, I only uh, uh, study the effect on immune function, effect on stress hormone. Effect uh, on the depression, like the psychological, psychological effect, like uh, uh, depression, fatigue, uh, yeah, uh, anger, some of the, yeah, what, psychological. What, what is it exactly that makes going into the f 
forest help mm. you with your anxiety or depression? What chemicals do you know? Chemicals. Yeah. Yeah. It's the phytoside. It's the phytoside to do that. Yeah, phytoside are chemicals. Lots of chemicals like uh, uh, alpha pinin. Yeah. The lemon. Yeah, the lemon. Okay. Alpha pinin, the lemon, and uh, yeah, many, many. About one hundred, about a hundred kind of chemicals. So the phytoside is a, is a total. Is a total. Yeah, total okay. mixture. Total mixture of the lot of. Chemicals. On, on, on what kind of does it work on our hormones of, or neurological? What does it do in the body? Oh, to the body, yeah. So they will, I think they will produce uh, stimulation your uh, sense of smell. Mm -hmm. Yeah, from the nose. So this is this, because it's uh, like a gas, like gas. Yeah, like gas. Uh, in the air, will uh, you can will uh, into the will into the body by yeah. the nose. Yeah. Yes. Also, because if you uh, up, yeah uh, inhale, if you inhale the aroma from the nose, so it will into your lung. Mm -hmm. That into your lung. Well, that will circulate, circulate in your whole body. And does it affect hormone like serotonin or? Yeah, serotonin, yeah. Yeah, yeah, serotonin, yeah. In fact, I thought that uh, force bleeding can increase the, the label, increase the label of the serotonin in blood. So it increases the serotonin. You know, so the, the serotonin is, the serotonin by some very simple with the depression. So the depression, people with the depression will show lower serotonin. So I thought that the first bit can increase the level of the serotonin. Yeah. Serotonin and a lot of analyzes stress because stress can induce, can induce a lot of diseases. For example, stress stress can uh, induce the heart heart disease. Uh, can induce can induce the hypertension. Yeah. Yeah. Can because it can in, yeah increase increases the blood pressure. Yeah. Also can yeah have the so can induce the panic disorder, eating disorder, and the, Sleeping, sleeping disorder, sleeping disorder. So stress can induce almost the diseases. You can, mm -hmm. yeah, you can name that. Yeah, lot of diseases. I can, you can, you can imagine, you can imagine that the stress can induce a lot of diseases. Yes. Yeah, so but uh, yeah. fourth patient can reduce stress. So fourth patient can have a preventive, preventive effect. A uh, lot of diseases. A preventive uh, effect. Uh, so, like, um, like the heart diseases. Mm. Can preventive the heart diseases. Can preventive the hypertension. Can preventive the, uh, preventive the uh, depression. And in fact, this effect is, uh, is produced by reducing stress hormone. So stress, uh, the stress hormone is a key word to understand the effect of forward beating. And only uh, two hours will last mm. for one week. Yeah. No, no, no. Four hours. Uh, four hours last for one four week. Four hours uh, can, yeah, can, can keep, keep the higher level for one week. Wow. The two nights, three days can keep one month. Everyone so should go. A, yeah. <laughs> Mm, yeah. Um, do, uh, can I ask you um, if there is a relation to sp uh, being spiritual or like having a spiritual experience when you're mm. in the forest? Have you experienced that yourself, or? Oh, you mean I take the forest for myself? 
yeah. Or is it is it for you also like a spiritual experience, like a ah, connection? Yes. Yeah. Mm, yeah. 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 It's a, maybe it's, it's something. Yeah. Because it's a uh, you know emotion. Emotion is very important. Yeah. The emotion is uh, like uh, uh, yes, it's very similar to that. Okay. So because the uh, environment can affect your emotion. The emotion is from the yeah many many factor factors can yeah influence your emotion your emotion your feeling yeah okay so it's uh, like some uh, some people call the sixth sense sixth sense yeah 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 <laughs> sixth sense. yeah yeah, it's, uh, yeah like happiness yeah because for example some forest is good for you but that forest may be not good for you. Oh. You, you, do you understand my yeah, meaning? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, yeah, it's a, it's a, yeah, like six things, you say. People will also call, call it the six things of happiness. Yeah. Because, yeah, maybe you, when you may visit uh, that forest, uh, you will feel happiness. But when you visit another forest, maybe you don't feel Oh. Happy. Sometimes I think maybe you have the experience for this. Yeah. So it's very, yeah, it's very difficult to, yeah, explain this, uh, yeah, if in fact, uh, but uh, it's true. Mm. But uh, I don't have data, but I don't <laughs> have data. I just a feeling. Yeah, I know. But uh, talking about feeling, I, I, there's mm. one uh, word in your book. It's a Jap Japanese yeah. word. Yeah, Japanese, uh, yeah. Uh, Yugen. Oh, you, oh, Yugen. Yugen. So, what does it mean? Japanese, old Japanese culture. So it's just about feeling. It's a feeling. So. In fact, Japanese have a special feeling about nature. The Japanese like nature, like for it from the old old time. What is that old time? Yeah. yeah. Because in Japan, in Japan there are two um, religion. So you mean two 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 kind of religion, Buddhism and Shintoism. Mm -hmm. So the both religion believe that the the forest, the nature of forest is a guide, is a, yeah, God of the, yeah, of so the human. So both religions see the forest as a, a, yeah. a believe, God, believe, God yeah, being. The, yeah, believe, yeah, yeah, believe the forest. There are a lot of uh, God, a lot of, uh, yeah, in the forest. Uh -huh. And that's what yeah. Yugen means? It's a Yugen, it's a Yugen. Yugen means the feeling. Yugen means the feeling yeah, people uh, feel the very comfortable when people in the nature. It's very similar to the biophilia, yeah, biophilia theory. Okay. So for example, for the Yugen, you just see the uh, sun, yeah, sun, sunset, sunset, and uh, find the, uh, yeah, the, Is this, the this nature. feeling that the, just... The, yeah. Yeah, so, 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 so you feel, you, you will feel very comfortable. Yeah. It's very, yeah, it's very difficult to describe it, describe it, but uh, you just uh, can, can use your feeling. Can I, can I say it, it feels like your head and your heart, you're like, yeah. everything yeah. just makes sense. Makes sense, yeah. yeah. Everything makes sense, everything, yeah, very in the, in, in, yeah, in the peace. Peaceful. Peace. Mm. Total, yeah, total peace. Mm. Oh, peaceful. beautiful. It's like a, a peaceful feeling. I love it. Um, uh, I, I really hope to do research myself. Yeah. Uh, including uh, forest bathing in yeah. the Netherlands. Yeah. Uh, and maybe looking at um, new research on psychedelics. Oh, uh, Because okay. psychedelics okay. make your... Um, um, increase neuroplasticity. Oh, oh yeah. And if you increase neuroplasticity, maybe mm. then also the effects of the mental well-being and the depression yeah. and the anxiety, mm. it will um, make the effect of the forest bathing even bigger. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, that's what I'm hoping uh, to start mm. in the Netherlands, to, to look at those mixtures. So oh, it's, it's forest okay, okay. therapy. Mm. So what what is your background of your yeah? I studied uh, I'm a psychologist. 
Yeah, a psychology. Ah, okay. Yes, yeah. and I did a research okay. master, so I did mm. a. Um, I'm a scientific uh, researcher in the psychological field. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Oh, oh, it's a good, yeah. Mm. And I studied personality, yeah. culture, mm. Um, mm. but I'm not uh, practicing now. Now I'm just an entrepreneur. <laughs> oh, okay. Mm. But so, so you, yeah, it's very important to, yeah, to do the research from the psycho psychological aspect. Yeah. Yes, and very scientific with uh, quantitative yeah. data, good measurements, control yeah. groups. Mm. So in the first place, maybe you can try use the POMS test. Yeah, I've, I know. Yeah, mm. the yeah, yeah. emotion. POMS test uh, yeah. Very good, yeah, yeah, very good, yeah, questionnaire to, yeah, to evaluate, evaluate the effect of heart breathing. Yes. And it's on mm. a uh, scale that measures uh, emotion, right? Emotion, yeah. yeah. So it's very good here. Yeah. Yeah. Good scale for the emotion, yeah. So you would do it like before they go into the forest and then afterwards and then maybe uh, af later. Yeah. yeah. So you can do two, two uh, composition. Compromise. One is the before and after the forest bathing. Another one is the forest bathing with the city walk. Forest bathing. So... That's more for example, same people, uh, same, same group, same group, the same group, uh, visits the fort base, visits the fort, and uh, also the, visits the city in the different day. Yeah, and then compare. Compare, yeah. yeah. So in my experiment, I usually use the city walking with the, versus the fort basing, with the same, with the same, uh, 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 physical activity. Yeah. Same distance at the same distance at the, uh, eat the same meal. Yeah. Everything so keep, is yeah. the same. All the environment is different. Yeah. And then one yeah. factor is that you research. Yeah. yeah. Um, yeah. It can look, I, I, I live in the forest, so I'm very uh, grateful for that, but maybe uh, or a lot of people live in the city or, mm. um, so can they, get the effect of forest baiting even if they're locked inside like with oh. house plants or videos so what can people do when they're at home and they cannot go so, outside okay so do you stay because of, because of the covid 19 maybe a lot of people have to yeah must to be uh, stay in the home so for the in the yeah for the uh, indoor, we call it indoor for forest bathing. So first, uh, you can use the essential oil. Yeah. Essential oil, use the humidifier. Use the humidifier to produce the essential oil, to produce the aroma. And is there any yeah. uh, essential oil in particular that's useful? So, so, so yeah, for, for, for me, I suggest to use the, uh, the uh, Japanese, Japanese cypress. Yeah, cypress, oil. yeah. Yeah. Uh, like pine, yeah, pine tree. Oh, yeah. So the essential oil from pine tree is very good. Mm. Mm, pine tree. Maybe you don't have the Japanese uh, cypress essential oil, but you can get the pine tree. Pine tree is good. Yeah. Mm. Okay. Essential oil from pine tree is, uh, I, I, yeah, you comment that for this. So you use, so this is a sense of the smell. You also can put some plant, flower, some, something in your room or in your workplace, in your office. Also, you also can watch, watch some DVD. So from the YouTube, you can find a lot of the, uh, yes, uh, the scenery, scenery from the forest. A DVD, yeah, DVD, lot of DVD about the uh, forest landscape. You also can, yeah, listen. You also can listen to the, listen to listen. the, uh, yeah, the, the, the sound of the forest. There are lot of, yeah, lots of uh, DVD, yeah, DVD and the YouTube program. You can, yeah, uh, not only see the beautiful scenery, also you can enjoy the, Sound of the forest recorded by the DVD. Yeah. Right. And so maybe 
At least you can use the three things. Sense of the smell, sense of the sight, sense of the hearing. So this is a total effect. So maybe you can produce a, a indoor for the atmosphere. I'm going to do this uh, at home. Yeah. With the humidifier. Fact, That's a good exactly. idea. In, in my office, I use, in my office, I use the essential oil every day. Yeah. I'm I use the humidifier during the winter. Mm. Yeah. To help, okay. of course. Um, if people want to learn more about uh, you or maybe uh, get a degree, uh, where do they need to look if they want more information? Oh, from my homepage. Um, I will uh, put it in the description. description yeah. Your homepage. You can, you can, yeah. You also can send an send email to me. You also can visit uh, our homepage. Okay. Do you know the, uh, the society, uh, the society of the nature and the forest for, for the medicine? Uh, society of forest medicine? That one? Mm, okay, we call the, or the international uh, society. No, oh, international society of the nature and the forest medicine. Yes, that one. Yeah, Informal, I have it here. Yeah. We, yeah, we updated some new news and data on, on our homepage. Okay, I will I will uh, uh, put the link in the description to that site yeah. for people. So the best way is, is to read my book. <laughs> <laughs> read my book, yeah. This if one. You, uh, yeah, this, oh, read, sorry. Read my book, yeah. Yes. Yeah, this book, yeah. It's a, it's a great book, and I love I love mm. all the pretty. Um, yeah, a lot of yeah, lot, lot of, of pictures. pictures. Yes. So, <laughs> lot of picture. This this. Uh, Japanese uh, uh, samples, I think you know that. This one. This one is a Japanese samples. Beautiful. Oh, beautiful, yeah. yeah. This, uh, okay. and, and what is behind you? What, what is the, the background? The trees as well? Oh, this is a picture. In Zoom, yeah, it's a picture. <laughs> oh, you too. <laughs> yeah, I, yeah, I upload the uh, picture, for the picture on my background. And, Zoom uh, background. It's good, it's good. My I like it, yes. Background. Yeah, yeah, it's perfect. Okay. Can I ask you <laughs> one uh, final question? Okay. Yeah. Um, uh, I always ask people if they can recommend uh, books that they like yeah. or love. What's your favorite uh, book to give to people? Oh. Not not your book, but maybe another book. Oh, <laughs> uh, you mean the uh, book in English? Eh? Yeah. Oh, only forest. Only forest bathing. Yeah, forest bathing. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> forest bathing are the forest medicine. For the forest medicine book, yeah, I will totally get that. Yeah, yeah love it. for the medicine. Yeah, it's a very good book. All right, it's like a Bible. Bible for <laughs> painting. <laughs> it's now on my wish list. Okay, I will buy it. Thank yeah. you. It's a public in America in mm. New York. Mm. Okay. Yeah, it's very good. Yeah, I yeah recommend people to read this book. Thank you. Okay, you're welcome. Um. For me, it's a. Uh, is there anything you would want to add or you want to tell to the Dutch audience uh, before we close up? Yeah. So let's take forest bathing to overcome the COVID nineteen. Take forest bathing to overcome COVID nineteen. Love yeah, it. So, you know, so let's go to the forest bathing to overcome the COVID nineteen. Great. Thank you, okay. Dr. Lee, for your time. Okay, so, uh, so yeah, you are welcome. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas <laughs> to you too and a happy new year. Okay. Yeah. After yeah, after just one week. After one week. Just one week. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> you Merry too. Merry Christmas. Yeah. Okay. Bye bye. You advice. Yeah, bye bye. <laughs>